and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for coming back. And if you're new, welcome to the wonderful world of me. Today, I'm back with another quick skincare video. I'll be taking you through my morning skincare routine. But before we get started, make sure to hit that subscribe button, give this video a huge thumbs up, and make sure you check out my videos from the past few weeks if you haven't. But without further ado, let's go. First product I use is the Glowpaw Antibacterial Honey Face Wash. Like I said in the review, this is a very hydrating face wash, not stripping on the skin at all, so I'd highly recommend it. But yeah, I rub it into my face and my neck. Cleaning your neck is key, people. There's no point in having beautifully smooth skin and then having a neck that looks like a crater. It's not okay. But yeah. I rinse it off with warm water and I pat it with a towel and we move on to the cleanser. I use a simple kind to skin range, the purifying cleansing lotion. I just um, add it onto a cotton pad and I sort of work it into my skin in circular motions. I clean my face, my neck and behind my ears. Cleaning it behind your ears is key. I see the back of you lots of your masterings and my lord, mm, your ears stink, I know they do. But yeah, Simple is a good brand to stop skincare with because they're affordable. They target sensitive skin, so that means not other skin types should really have adverse effects to their products. And they use products that aren't stripping to the skin, so overall, like, it's a good product to start with. Let me follow the cleanser with the toner. I just use the same toner from the same brand, just because my skin seems to like the pairing, but you don't have to use the same toner. You can use what you want, but toners are a good way to sort of end your cleansing process and sort of set your face up for the serums if you use serums which I will go on to now then we come in with the ordinary hyaluronic acid and B5 this is great for hydrating your skin so if you have dry skin I would definitely recommend using a hyaluronic acid but it's great for all types of skin because all skin needs moisture and hydration so we just put a few drops on my face and we rub it into my skin and my neck then we move on to another glow pot product Vitamin ACE serum. This has hyaluronic acid again, so we are trying to hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. But it also helps the production of collagen and it helps with breakouts, so win win for the crew, for the gang. Then I use another hydrating serum. This is from Superdrug. Listen, I'm trying to have dry skin. It's, 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 mad. it's, it's mad. But I mostly focus on my cheeks because that's where my driest areas are. Then I just sort of let the rest of the product spread across my face because no dry skin here thank you then i come behind with a homemade product it's my homemade shea butter and coconut oil mix if you want to know how i made that let me know down below but that's basically my skincare routine and then um i didn't do this on camera but apply spf apply spf yeah and that is it for my skincare routine as always thank you guys so much for watching and i'll be back next week with my even skincare routine but until then check out my other skincare videos over here check out videos from me and my life over here hit that subscribe button give this video a huge thumbs up leave some comments down below and i will see you in next week's video peace Mwah!